Hey, Shalom. First, I would like to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shah, Bahashim Rakakadash, Yahweh, who the world ignorantly calls God, Yahweh Shah, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus. I want to give a double honor to the apostles of Great Millstone who have taught me this truth. I want to give it peace and blessings to the eye came across the four corners of the earth who teach this truth and rest of life to do so. It's going to be a quick video. Low willing the videos edifying, low willing I can get something from this video. A um, couple things I want to go through uh, in Sirach 13. It's going to be a quick video. Um, just advice for Akim who got to deal with bullshit at the workplace. You know, you're going to have to deal with certain things at the workplace because these people got demons on them, man. These people got all kind of wicked ass spirits on them. And when you're a man of honor, you're a man of truth, and you're a man of integrity, you're going to be attacked. And these people have demons. See, look. The difference between us and, and two thirds of these people are the heathens uh, that dwell in this world and rule this world. And the two thirds that follow suit is that Satan already got them. Okay. Satan already, they don't, they don't resist anything. They don't, they don't, they, they fully fulfill the pleasures of their flesh. Okay. They, they don't resist anything, but what's happening, right? Satan is working to try to get you. He's always worked to try to get the saving servants. He's always worked to try to test the service. Look at the story of Job. Look what he did to Yahweh Shai. Okay? These people have demons on them, man. And you can see it in their fucking face. Right? But we, we, we have to move wise. Right? Well, scriptures say, um, be wise as a serpent and harmless as doves. And I understand that scriptures also say in Mark 9 and 42, that he that offendeth one of the little ones that believe in me, which is Yahweh Shai, it is better that a millstone was hung about his neck and he was cast into the sea. Okay? So we need not to worry. Although these people can't press the fucking limit sometimes, man. Okay? Trust me. Right? They can push the limit sometimes, but we still have to move wisely. Okay? And we ain't even really got to touch nobody or do nothing because little do they know, they, they don't know who, like how Jake said in the world, you don't know who you fucking with. They don't know who they fucking with, man. You understand? So... Their actions are going to take care of themselves. Their wicked deeds that they're doing towards you is going to take care of themselves, man. It's going to end up wiping their ass out, man. Okay? Everybody who troubles Akim, everybody who trouble a man of the Lord will be destroyed, man. Will be destroyed, man. And you will pay for everything you've done. Okay? Whether you Jake or not. <laughs> you know? This is Sirach 13 and 3. It says, The rich man hath done wrong. And yet he threateneth withal. The poor is wrong, and he must entreat also. It says, If thou be for his prophet, he will use thee. So if you be for a rich man prophet, he'll use you. Okay? Because they're so they're they're greed, they're so tied up with filthy lucre. Okay? You can see it in your churches, right? It says, uh, for it says, But if thou have nothing, he will forsake thee. So if if you have nothing, nigga let you go, or eat him out of let you or he'll forsake you. I ain't fucking with you. Because you have nothing to give them. You have they have nothing to profit off you, man. Okay, this is five. It says, If thou have anything, he will live with thee. Yeah, he will make thee bear and will not be sorry for it. So if you have anything, he'll live with you. He'll plead with you, man. You know, he'll keep you around. But if you ain't got shit, he'll make you know, but he'll make you bear. But if you ain't got shit, he ain't fucking with you. Okay, that's why scriptures say it's impossible to know a friend in the in the in a time of, of prosperity. You only know your friends in a time of adversity, man. Okay, scriptures don't lie and they don't fail. It says, um, it says six, it says, if he have need of thee, he will deceive thee and smile upon thee and put thee in hope. He will speak thee fair and say, what wantest thou? See, he'll speak thee fair. He'll put you in hope and say, what, what do you want? Quick testimony, right? I, I was at a, I still work there, right? But I'm, I'm working on getting out. I work, um. Uh, at a, uh, I work, I ain't gonna say where I work at, but I work in an industry where a lot of, you know, I work with a lot of people who make a lot of money, right? And I had an opportunity <clears throat> to go to the next level, right? A level above where I'm at right now, right? And this, this opportunity, right, was a life-changing opportunity. This opportunity was, I'm talking about, you know, life-changing opportunity, man. I had an opportunity to make anywhere between you know, fifteen or twenty thousand dollars a month, right? But they told me I would have to choose between that and the scriptures, right? They told me I would, cause I we go to preach and teach on Saturday, <laughs> all right? 
So they was like, hey, Saturday is one of our busiest days. I can't promote you if you go teach and preach, if you go do your religion thing on Saturday. So I told them, man, fuck that, fuck that, uh, fuck that, uh, that promotion, right? Because the Lord, man, you forsake, look at the uh, 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 story of uh, Daniel, right? You forsake the riches of this world that the devil try to throw at you through people. The Lord will bless you with something more than you, what you thought you could, what you thought, right? I have faith that the Lord will give me something way more than what the fuck they even have to offer. Okay. Look at the story of Daniel, man. He didn't, he didn't become one of the tops in Babylon because of, you know, because of his connections or because, uh, you know, he was in good with, you know, Nebuchadnezzar and nothing like that. No, he came, he became one of the top guys because he had fear and he followed Yahweh, man. Okay. He prophesied Yahweh. He prophesied, man. He broke down dreams. He had faith in Yahweh, Yahweh Shai. And we have to have faith in Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, regardless of what happened, man. Regardless of what you get or what you don't get, regardless. Right? Because it's, it's good. The most I got some way more in store than what a fucking Edom I could offer. Okay? This is seven. It says, and, and, and keep in mind, right? These people have taken all kind of shit from me, man. Uh, You know, I, I've had a, you know, Man, I had an instance where, you know, to get the position I was getting promoted to, I had to go against this Edomite boy who'd been here eight months, eight, nine months. I was there for two years, and he'd been here eight, nine months and got invited to go to the next level. And then I've been here two years and barely got invited to go to the next level. So they made us verse each other in school, and I end up beating his test scores in school. And, they, you know, I end up beating his test scores in school, and they still promoted him over me before they even knew before the owner claimed he knew or not the owner but the 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 head manager uh knew uh um that i that i prophesy do you know that i do my so-called religion thing on saturday that's what they say right so he act like he ain't knew he ain't know and then when he found out he's like oh no 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 you got to choose between the two man i looked that man in the eye and said man listen forget it forget 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 the promotion okay but they'll use you, man. Okay, they'll use you, man. They'll use you, man. I got another dude that I grew up under since I was 19, man. Started the business with. Um, that's trying to, you know, backdoor me on some. That already tried to backdoor me. So you get attacked on all angles, but they can do nothing. Why? Why can't they do what they want to do? Because I fear you. How why you how was shy, man? Okay. Man, if Yahweh Yahweh Shah is on my side, who could be against me? Not a soul. So we need not to worry, man. Okay? And seven it says, and he will shame thee by his meats until he have drawn thee dry twice or thrice. And at the last he will laugh thee to scorn afterward. When he seeth thee, he will forsake thee and shake his head at thee. Beware that thou be not deceived and brought down in thy jollity. Check this out. It says, if thou be invited of a mighty man, withdraw thyself so much, the more will he invite thee. So if you be invited by some a mighty man, especially at the job or the workplace or just anywhere, right? Don't, 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 don't go with it. Okay? Don't go with it. But also don't stand too far back because he'll forget you as the scripture is going to say. Okay? And also, I didn't even uh, go over this. In, in 6, it says, if thou, if he have need... Hold on, give me one second. It says, if he have need of thee, he will deceive thee and smile upon thee. So yeah, if he have need of you, he'll deceive you and smile upon you to get what he needs from you. And he'll put you in hope with vain talks. I got conversations recorded. This from this, ex what this exact scripture is breaking down or, 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 or saying, I got ex conversations recorded, man. Of them motherfuckers trying to sell me a dream. You know? I let Akim listen to her. Akim was pissed off. <laughs> you know, the brother talks about was pissed off, man. Okay, but let me go down at, uh, back at eight. It says, Beware that thou be not deceived and brought down in, in thy jollity. If thou be invited of a mighty man, withdraw thyself in, in so much, the more will he invite thee. It says, Press thou not upon him, lest thou be put back. Stand not far off, lest thou be forgotten. 
so we gotta supplant man you gotta be there but be be close but be far at the same time if that makes sense it's 11 it says affect not affect not to be made equal unto him to, to him and talk and believe not his many words for with much communication will he tempt thee and smiling upon thee will will get out thy secrets and this exact thing this exact thing is going on with me right now of the guy who's trying to backdoor me that i've been doing since i was 19. you know but this is one if you read the 48 laws of power this is one of the power moves you know never outshine the master see all those books they get it from the scriptures man all these movies this all plagiarized from the scriptures man okay all the so-called knowledge and wisdom these people copy which they get from you know the scriptures right it all comes from the scriptures okay period man scriptures reign supreme if you understand it if you don't understand it you're gonna read it like a book and be fucking lost as soon as you finish revelation okay because you don't read the scriptures like that you read line upon line here a little there a little okay precept upon precept this is 12 says but cruelly he will lay up thy words and will not spare to do thee hurt yeah he'll fuck you up it says and to put thee in prison observe and take good heed for thou walkest in peril of thy overthrowing when thou hearest these things awake in thy sleep love the lord all thy life and call upon him for thy salvation okay now let me i typed in greed earlier and a couple scriptures popped up that i wanted to get get to it says it says um proverbs 15 27 this is a good one it says he that is greedy of gain troubleth his own house but he that hateth gifts shall live okay and we also know a gift destroyeth the heart okay so don't let the motherfuckers give you a gift because you'll be like oh this he ain't so bad we'll do no 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 that motherfucker's terrible that's why scriptures say never trust thy enemy because his iron rusts the soul of his wickedness proverbs 21 and 6 26 it says he coveteth greedily all the day long but the righteous giveth and spareth not that's what the righteous do okay you know um let me go up it says so are many ways every that is greedy and gain which take it let's go to proverbs 1 and 19 it says uh proverbs 1 and 15 it says my son walk not thou in the way of with them refrain thy foot from their path for their feet run to evil and make haste to shed blood okay it says right here this is what's talking about this is 10 it says my son if sinners entice thee consent thou not okay it says my son walk not thou in this 15 walk not thou walk not thou my son walk not thou in the way with them refrain thy foot from their path for their feet run to evil and make haste to shed blood okay and that's true okay let me go down i'm gonna jump down to 19 it says so are the ways of everyone that is greedy of gain which taketh away the life of the owners thereof wisdom cries oh that's it it says um no let me go to 17 it says surely in vain the net is spread inside of any bird and they lay wait for their own blood they lurk privily for their own lives so are the ways of everyone that is greedy of gain which taketh away the life of owners thereof man so don't be greedy man we get a lot further not being greedy man to give alms right a greedy motherfucker ain't gonna give no alms man but you blessed for the alms that you get so a lot of people don't understand that the reason why we win one of the reasons why we win as being men uh, of yahweh yahweh shy lord willing i'm part of one of those men lord willing i'm part of one of those joint heirs of yahweh shy we win because we're not greedy okay we give alms man we're brotherly we're not like these people so we got to move different and always think different we are leaders man scripture said we were called from the chiefest of men okay remember that chiefest of men is your top guys who are worshipped in this world celebrities singers movie actors all that shit right we were called from them man for chance of salvation that we might receive the problems like it says in hebrews the 10th chapter okay so with that man lord willing videos edifying lord willing, i can got some from this video i want to give all praise honor and glory to you i will buy shimmy i was shy by shimmy i want to tell you brothers keep pushing lord will not keep pushing on to the next shallow one